What's up, good people, aka winners? That's what we do. Hey, that's all we do. Hey, 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 hey. I'm coming to you with another video. Coming to you with another video. Ficky, Ficky, hey. What's up, good people? Siki here, and I'm coming to you with another video, and the main video, now here's the thing. Y'all know I always gotta like break it down, break it down on time. I always have to talk to y'all in the beginning, but wait, 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 wait. But wait though, before we get started, make sure that you join the fam fam by subscribing. And here's a little situation, or here's a little thing. I have been receiving comments that, oh my gosh, I'm so happy you're back. You were gone so long. Girl, I've been here, okay? Now, I may have, there's been times where I've uploaded like after like two weeks or whatever, but I have definitely been here and I've definitely been uploading. So if you haven't been seeing my videos like for months or, or weeks on weeks on weeks, chances are you need to update your subscription or um, customize your notifications because YouTube is always changing. Matter of fact, social media is always changing. So just make sure that you know you got me on lock, okay? I am going to do a video. Let me show y'all. Look where I went, girl, look where I went, girl, the M, the A, the C, A. <laughs> anyway, I went to Mac, so I was scrolling the gram, okay? And I saw that Ruby Roo, Ru, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I saw that Ruby Woo now has the Ruby Crew. Now, I don't know, like raise your hand if you know about Ruby Woo. I mean, if you're a Mac fan and you've been a Mac fan, like you definitely know about Ruby Woo. Now, I absolutely love the retro matte lipstick formula by Mac and I have quite a few of them look booyah y'all even know I did a video when they first came out with this formula right here and I did a video I did like a lip swatch video all by myself and because I say all by myself because you know me and my daughter used to do them a lot but I have their retro matte lipstick collection I have a lot of their retro mattes and so that is literally one of my favorite formulas from MAC. Um, and I don't even really like the bullets anymore. And so when I saw that, I was like, oh, I need to try it. But then as I began to look, hold on, because I got to pull that joker up real quick so that I can explain to you guys the differences. And then I am going to do an eye look, but I haven't determined if I'm going to do it separate or not. I don't know if I'm, and, and this look, I'm, I guess I'm going to call it like the Marilyn Monroe, this like little natural look. That's what they kind of call the Marilyn Monroe. But um, depending on how long this video is, girl, because I'm going to get y'all swatches too, I might break it up. Ruby Woo, the original, the originator, the OG, the original gangster, <laughs> the bullet lipstick. I told them to give me a mini one, but they gave me the regular size and I wasn't really here for that. But this one is Ruby Woo. This is the packaging for this collection. Still has that like vanilla scent. This is um, a retro matte zero shine matte finish and I'm gonna try them all on but that right there is Ruby Woo I mean y'all Ruby Woo is the perfect like red for any and everybody so if you never heard of Ruby Woo you're welcome so this one is um Ruby Fume now here's the thing it's it's P-H-E you no i'm sorry it's p-h-e-w right and so when i first called and had them put it on hold for me i was like so how do y'all pronounce that because i uh, like i automatically want to say pew pew but p-h is the f sound right the f sound and so it's probably fume so when i first called they were like you know how people say when you look fine they go phew phew i was like no not really but okay Okay, I never heard of that. I mean, where have I been, right? And so then when I went to pick it up, the guy was like, oh no, I think it's pew pew. So I'm like, listen, whatever it is, I don't care. So anyway, the retro matte, and it does look like it's a different color because the formulas are different, okay? They're all different formulas. So this retro matte is, um, it's a liquid lipstick, and this is my favorite, but it most definitely can be very, very drying. Just so you guys know, Ruby Woo is usually drying. So then they came out with the Powder Kiss lipstick, but I wasn't able to get that because it was out of stock, okay? And then um, they have a powder, the Powder Kiss liquid lip color. And so 
as I was reading, this one is supposed to be more hydrate, a more hydrating formula, and I've never tried that. So I think that I'll probably rock this one like today for the rest of the day, just to see how it goes. But this one is a more hydrating formula. The um, applicator is definitely different, but I do like that the retro matte lipstick has like a pointy, a pointy um, applicator because when I get into that little cupid's bow right there, baby, it allows me to just perfect that and be so precise with the best precision ever. Okay. They came out with a lip glass. Now I've never seen a Ruby Woo lip glass, but I'm going to try it all on for you. I just had to talk about it because I was excited about this. So I will go ahead and I'll put the link to, you know, this collection so that you guys can purchase it if you like. And so this is the lip glass. Even if you do have one of the rubies that are very drying, you can always coat it with this lip glass right here. And so then I also picked up something else. This is not part of the collection, but I picked it up. This is just a little sidebar. Okay. This is just for free. So I picked up this brow pencil. It is in the shade Strut. S-T-R-U-T. S-T-R-U-T. <laughs> anyway, it's Strut. I, oh wait, it has a spoolie on it. I wasn't trying to do that. I was trying to do this. And I use this pencil when I rock red hair. Okay. Because it helps my brows. Like, you know how it's like a brown right now, like a dark brown. When I rock my red unit, I actually put a little bit of this in the brow and it helps it match my red unit. And so I'll just show you. It's really like a, a, a kind of like an auburn kind of color, but it helps me. You see that it kind of gives like a little bit of a red undertone. So it helps it not look so dark and it blends with the hair. So FYI, if you are a redhead or Auburn, whatever it is, that will help you. That will change your life. We're back like we never left. Also, if you guys want me to put this in the description box, I did purchase this like this headband wig. If y'all want me to put that in the description box, I will. Oh, girl, I got on the AirPod. Dear Lord of heaven. Oh, but we're going to do these lippies. So first we're going to start and listen, you got to have the aquaphor on deck. Okay. Whenever you're doing lip swatches, you got to have the aquaphor on deck. So, and your wipes. Okay. And, um, for now I've been using the simple it's by simple um the makeup wipes cleansing wipes and they have been working out great for me i got them from target so this is the first one this is ruby woo and i'ma speed it up but a you girl now the original ruby woo is very drying okay and this is the bullet When I tell you this is the perfect red for so many different skin tones, the original, the OG, but that one is very drying. So please note if you are looking to purchase that one that is drying Ruby Woo. Here's the thing about rock and red lipstick. You want to, and I didn't really do it um, before I did this video cause I knew we were going to be swatching, but I am going to take my beauty blender and just do a little more concealing around the lips and you can actually go over it with concealer with like a brush afterwards. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't work that hard. I don't do that. I just make sure that I conceal all these dark areas. So this is the retro matte, which is my favorite. It has my favorite applicator on, but I will tell you guys, if you're wearing this for an extended amount of time, it is definitely drying. <music> Now this is a drier formula. So when you are, you know, layering and applying more or making sure that you have the application like precise, you want to move quickly because once it dries down, when you start adding more to it, it does, you can begin to see it cause it's just so drying. Right. But I do love the retro matte formula. I'm gonna come closer and show you guys this formula as well. This one is the Ruby few or pium pium as I like to say, but as you can see, it's drying. And when you go to fill that in again, um, it will, you know, show the lines if you don't distribute it very quickly before it sets. This one definitely stays all day, but I'm not going to say it's smudge proof because yes, it was on like when I drank out of a glass, it did come off on the glass, but I'm here for the Ruby few. That is my favorite formula. Now what I'm going to do is I am going to put the gloss on top so you guys can see how the gloss looks this is the wait a minute girl wait a minute wait a, okay this is the ruby woo the ruby woo gloss it's just straight ruby woo gloss so i'm gonna put that on top just in case you do like gloss and that's too drying for you you can put it on top but i'm also gonna show it um 
by itself. That's real juicy. I'm not really a juicy type girl, but that's juicy. That's on top of the ruby few. The gloss is very thick. So I'm gonna wipe that off, show you guys the gloss by itself, and then I'm gonna do the one that I'm gonna wear today, which is gonna be the Ruby Boo. Put on some Aquaphor, but because I'm doing the gloss, I'm not gonna do that. So this is the gloss by itself. Shoot, it's pretty thick. Oh my God, I thought it was like a little transparent, but this is some like opaque gloss, y'all. It's thick like lipstick. Girl, ooh, that's thick. So what that tells me is that she's gonna stay there. Wow, if you're really into gloss, this is a beautiful gloss. This looks like candy, candy. <laughs> All right, Ruby Boo, right here, Ruby Boo. And I do like the frosted bottle. Wait, is the other one like that? I didn't even know. The Ruby Fume. Nope, it's not frosted. That was smart. You would think that for the matte one, the extreme matte one, they would give you the frosted bottle. But anyway, I'm just, I'm thinking into it too much. So this is Ruby Boo. This is supposed to be more hydrating and it, it seems a little more matte going on. I'm gonna use this one today cause I'm gonna have it on a while. And it's like a, um, oh no, it makes sense. I, I see why they did that cause of the powder. It's a powder kiss formula. It feels extremely soft. I love the, I love, I love how it feels. So what I have to say about this, the applicator is not as hard to use as I thought it would be. And also in this collection, it came with a red lip liner and it also came with a um, with a lip primer. Now the lip liner, I don't really use lip liners on, you know, when I do lipstick that much anymore. However, a lip liner will help it from um, bleeding. You know what I mean? It'll kind of keep it in the pocket. I really like the feel of this one. And I feel like, like when you do the matte one, the original matte as well, as the um, retro matte, I ain't gonna even lie, once it sets in place, it's like you have a mask on your face. It's like, like you know what I'm saying? It, it has that drying effect on it. It's not really buttery, but it's almost like a, like they say, powder kiss. It does have this powdery, soft, like feeling to it. And um, I just can't wait to see how it goes on throughout the day, but stay tuned, watch my Instagram and all that good stuff. I did a twofer, okay? So if you want to see exactly how I did this eye look, then definitely check out the video. I don't know what I'm gonna title it. I think maybe my go-to natural eye look or something like that. I hope this helped you guys. Let's get some chats going on in the comment section and thank you so much for watching you guys have an awesome blessed day and I'm not gonna say that I will see you sooner than you think but your girl will see you soon love ya bye he be me. confidence is key you know what I mean a woman feels good when she's looking pretty I don't need no Benz Lexus or a Range Rover just give your girl a bomb see key beauty makeover